Oh, what a gem we got here, buddy. What a gem. Lucky, lucky, lucky here. Oh, brand new. She's brand new. Oh, yeah. Got the weight reduction in the rust. Ready. Good morning, Fox Body Fanatics. Hey, look, I want to make a video. I bought a car yesterday, and I want to show you how I, uh, I uh, live by my own advice here. And I buy them in any condition, man. I love them. But I want to play a game with you guys, okay? I'm going to show you this car, and I'm going to ask you guys to tell me what it what it's worth, okay? I want you to tell me what I paid for it, and uh, it should be a fun game. I'm not going to reveal it in this video. I'll reveal it on the next video coming up and see who's gotten closer. Actually, you know what? I'll do this. Let's do a contest. If you can hit the exact number that I paid for this car, and this doesn't count for the people who were involved with this purchase, but if you can hit the exact number that I paid for this car, I'll send you out some Fox Body Rehab stickers um, on me. You know, just let's let's play a little game. Are you guys ready? Are you ready? You sure you're ready? All right. Well, here we go. What do you think? 85 coupe, full rye, not bad condition, not great condition. So we got, let's see, a nice four eye hood, engine bay, uh, looks like there's a little bit of rust right there, but the frame rails are high and tight like they're supposed to be. Firewall looks good, heck, even the core support don't look too bad. All right, so there's that. Let's get you this side view. Oh. It's got the detachable uh, mirror, which was an option, I believe, in 85, and the weight reduction uh, rot on the bottom of the door for the 85, 86, which is typical. I think it came factory that way. Uh, we're missing a window here, but uh, fear not, because there is a piece of plexiglass that has been cut out for it. So, uh, hold on a second, hot rod. All right, we got a dashboard. We got crank up windows. Well, the ones that are here, that door's missing it. Oh, we got some Thunderbird center caps. Uh, a little bit of rot in the floor down here, but the uh, remainder of it doesn't look too bad. The have that control controls are in place. Oh, pillars. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Come on. It didn't have a back window. I had to put a window in it just to cover the hole up. So, yeah, I mean, it's, uh, it's very yellow, right? Very yellow. What does something like this cost nowadays? What's a fair price for something of the sort? What would you pay? A lot of people love the 4 eye coupes, but not a lot of people out there are about ready to do that work to make this thing nice again. It's got the 8.8 rear end underneath of it already. It's not an original 5.0 car. Um, let's see, was it original auto or manual? Okay, that uh, it was an automatic car, given that transmission tunnel hump. So it was an automatic car. Oh boy, cruise control. She was fancy, boy. She was fancy back in the day. That window's in place, luckily. So, okay. Uh, I don't have the key to open the trunk, I don't think, but we can take a peek through the hard way. You can see we've got the louver, luckily, and we've got the trim. The floor pans in the trunk actually look pretty solid, at least from here. I don't see any rot in the bottom of the quarter panel, so I would consider this to be a builder, right? I mean, this isn't a junker. This isn't a complete parts car turd. I've seen worse. Hell, I built worse. So what do you think? Let's play a game, shall we? And the winner of this game that hits the number exactly of what I paid for the car um, is going to get a sticker pack. I'll send you three or four of them out there. Since I don't have shirts printed yet, I'll give a sticker. Not bad. I mean, that door's rotted, but the, uh, the other one's not. Let's see what that looks like from the bottom. Yeah, oh yeah, trash, Ola. trash. Sure, it could be fixed. Ooh, it looks like a uh, sand beige, original color car before it went uh, very yellow. It's very yellow. Oh, let's check this other A-pillar. I haven't even looked at it. Just open, damn it. Ooh, wee. She's nice, guys. She's nice. We got a little bit of the, that high performance yellow flaking off, you know? That's what happens with the high performance paint jobs that they put on these things, but this door, Oh, uh, she's just barely starting to show it. It can still be cleaned out and saved. Oh, man, you hear how good that sounded when it closed? Jesus Christ, this is a new one? It could be a new one. One of them brand new 85 models. Well, guys, let's play that game. Fox Body Values. What's this one worth? What would, uh, what would you think that in Houston, Texas, a person would pay for a car like this? What's the value? That's the headline for this video. What's the value? You tell me, guys. 
I'll announce the winner and the big correct price that I actually gave for this car on the next video. It comes out along with the, uh, the picture of the sticker pack that I'm going to send out to the lucky, lucky, lucky guy that calls this one out. Fox Body Rehab, guys. You tell me what it's worth.